So when did you first discover EDM? Um, before it was called EDM, strangely enough, back in the 90s. Uh, I think it was called just rave music then. Uh, I guess music that sounds like what people would call drum and bass these days. Um, acid house music, kind of like the prodigy sounding type stuff. Now, does your club set differ to your festival sets? Totally. Yep. How so? Uh, I think you can just play more bangers in the festival set. You know, people up for it, more hands in the air moments. Uh, with club sets, you can kind of dig a little bit deeper and maybe surprise people a little bit. <laughs> so what does 2017 have in store for you? Uh, it has um, a lot of pizza, a lot of beer, love Heineken beer, love pizza. Uh, uh, what else? Uh, just, you know, just taking uh, my George FM drive show to the next level and, yeah, just keeping, um, keeping up with the music production as well, yeah. So with your drive show, what is it that you look for in a new track to play? Uh, it's got to be unique and it's kind of got to be, you know, maybe a little bit of a reference to the old school or a, a sound that might, people might find familiar in some way, but at least someone doing it in a new style. <laughs> right, where can we go online to follow you, what you're up to, where you're playing? Um, just on my Facebook page, on my Instagram, yeah. Cool, thank you for your time. Cheers, Mel. Hey, I'm Dan Ox, and this has been Push Play TV.